Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to WWT Wrestling or WWT episodes. Last episode, our pay per view been Extreme Limit. The Rock won the Intercontinental Championship. Also, Stone Cold Steve Austin still has his legendary streak slash title reign. Austin has almost beat everybody in WWT Wrestling. But tonight, we will hear what Michael has to say about the I Quit match against The Rock. And more importantly, about losing his Intercontinental Championship. Everybody, thank you so much for coming, liking, and uh, subscribing. We appreciate every single one of you. Make sure you subscribe, turn on notifications, and also make sure you watch this video all the way through without skipping, and you'll be a part of the Awesome Squad. Let's get on with the action here tonight. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Introducing first, we have Ta Jerry. And his opponent making his way to the ring now. One half of the WF Tag Team Champions, Kane. Yes, WWT Wrestling bought out WWF. Kane now entering the ring, and he is a force to be reckoned with here, ladies and gentlemen. He's looking right at Jerry. Obviously, no fear at all in the Big Red Machine, Kane. And here we go now, and Jerry going right after the Big Red Machine. Kane now. Whoa! Whoa! God threw him up in the air. Oh, and a huge clothesline, turning Jerry inside out here. Oh, a huge uppercut. Off the ropes, but can no! Oh! Hurricane Rana! Springboard! Standing dropping, knocking on the big red machine. Jerry's on a roll here. And now. Oh god, he was. Kane now looking to put his opponent away. Oh! Huge choke slam! And now he picks him up here. Here we go! Tombstone! Cover one! Two, three. God damn, what a matchup. It may have been short, folks, but obviously these men put their role in this matchup. I mean, come on. What What do you expect when an athlete like Jerry goes in the ring with an athlete like Kane? Hey, Orton. Uh-oh. What the hell do you want, Jericho? Damn it, Randy Orton. You cost me my match at Extreme Limit. I never even interfered in your match. You're just bitching and complaining like usual. No, before, before that pay-per-view even started, the episode before that pay-per-view even started, you RKO'd me off the announcer table, threw another table, and injured me. So I was injured going into that match against Triple H for that WWE Wrestling World Classic Movie Championship. So you're accusing me of costing you your title match. Well, you know what? You did, damn it. You know, besides Triple H, you are the one of the most whiniest people backstage. One of these days, someone might just teach you a lesson and put you in your place. The following contest is a triple threat matchup. Interesting first, we have Val Venus and his opponent, Maven. And making his way to the ring now, Paul Burchill. And here comes Paul Burchill now, not messing around. Walking up those staircase, hopping in the ring. And he's ready to fight his opponents here tonight. And here we go, folks. And now, Paul Burchill, what is it? Oh, what a maneuver to Val Venus. And now, standing drop kick by Maven. Maven now, right hand, hands there. And now, oh, Paul Burchill with a drop kick. And now, wait a minute. Oh, Val Venus throws over the top rope. And the big Val Bowski now. Being the hell out of Maven in the corner here. We haven't seen. Oh, we haven't seen Val Venus in such a long time. Oh, and he plants him with a DDT there. And he goes for a cover. One, two, but Paul Burchill now. Paul Burchill. Oh, right hand. Uh, right to uh, Val Venus there. And now, oh, chair shot. Oh, to the back. And now Maven. Oh, cross body over the top rope to the floor. And now Maven's going for a suplex. But no. Oh, God, what a huge suplex. He throws him into the corner. And now, Maven, oh, no, what is this? Don't tell me. Oh, God, look at the hang time on that DDT, damn it. And now he throws him. He throws his carcass back into the ring. And now, oh, Val Venus goes face first into that steel ring pole. What's he going to do here now? And now, oh, Paul Burchill now. What is this? Oh, a gut run power bomb! One, two, three! And here's your winner, Paul Burchill! What a hell of a matchup! What the hell does John Cena want?
Kurt Angle, the Pittsburgh native. You think you're the best in WWE, don't you? You think you're so damn good, huh? Well, newsflash, kid, you're not as good as you think. Whoa, whoa, wait a damn minute, Cena. I obviously am that damn good, because if you look around my waist, I am the WWE Champion. Then how about you put that belt where your mouth is and face me here tonight for that championship belt? Well, then you better get ready for a TLC match and get ready for your ass to be whipped. Enough talk. Let's fight. Good. Oh, my God. You gotta be kidding me. A TLC match right here, right now for the WWE Wrestling Championship. This is gonna be one hell of a matchup, folks. There we go. The WWE Championship raising up there. The following contest is a TLC match, and it is for the WWE Championship. Here's the first challenger, John Cena, and his opponent in the ring now. He's the current defending WWE Champion, Kurt Angle. Guys, this is very positive. Kurt Angle will put the championship belt on the line right now. TLC matchup, and here we go. And Cena now. Oh, wait a minute, Cena. Oh, get the belly to belly suplex. Another belly to belly, a huge forearm, and hip toss. Kurt Angle obviously putting Cena in his place here, but no, now John, oh, John Cena with a knockdown, and a huge right hand, and now Angle, oh, wait a minute, oh, good lord, he took him out there. Angle's got that steel chair, but John Cena, oh, John Cena kicked him right in his face, and now Cena. Cena with the steel chair now, and wait, no, he's beating the hell out of him. Oh, right hands, and now he goes to get the steel chair once more. Oh, God, did you see it? Did you hear that crack over the skull? At this point, Cena's just punishing his opponent, and now he's got him up here. F you, oh, F you to Kurt Angle on top of that steel folding chair. Oh, and he throws him into the canvas there. What the hell, Cena's got that huge ladder. Oh. Oh, God. And he's going to need it in order to win this uh, championship ladder match. TLC match. Oh, no. Oh, God. A suplex on top of that ladder. Angle's got to be broken in half. Good Lord. And now Cena's got those steel steps. But, oh, Angle kicks him in the face there. And now Angle with the right hand knocking him down. What is this? No. Oh, Olympic slam. Olympic slam. Holy crap. And now he's got that chair. Oh, God, what a chair shot to the skull. Back body drop. Oh, my God, he went head first. Did you see that? Cena now, setting up that ladder. What the hell is Cena doing? He, he's got that ladder, and those steel steps propped up. Oh, my God. No, no, no. What the hell is Cena going to do here? Cena throws it back into the ring. This is not looking good, peeps, at all. And now, wait a minute. Kurt Angle. Oh, my God, no. Kurt Angle has got him up here don't tell me he's got him up olympic slam no oh god oh my god did you see that he hit the ladder look at the ladders busted i think cena mostly got the steel steps but either way he's hurt bad angle gonna do anything to protect his championship belt and now oh oh he drops it on cena there he's kicking the hell out of cena and throws him into the ladder and now he's setting up that table. He's setting up that table now. And Kurt Angle, Kurt Angle. Oh, Olympic slam, Olympic slam through that table. That should buy him some time here as he throws the ladder in the middle of the ring. Cena better hurry the hell up because Kurt Angle's setting up that, that massive ladder and the ladder's busted. They busted the ladder for God's sake. Good Lord, you've got to be kidding me. Holy crap, and on Angle. Angle slowly climbing that ladder. He's almost to his championship belt here. But Cena's up, and now Cena, oh, a chair shot. And, oh, good Lord, he tilted the ladder over. Oh my God, look what Cena set up on the outside. Cena not messing around. He is ready to inflict a lot more punishment than needed to win this championship. Cena's got Angle up. No way, no way he's gonna do this. Wait a minute, oh my God. Oh, F you, F you, through three tables. Angle's hurt, damn it. Cena's got to hurry the hell up here. He's buying himself some time. He's climbing that ladder. Holy crap, Cena's got the title. Cena's got the title. 
Here's your winner and new WWTE champion, John Cena. Holy crap, Cena's done it. Cena put his money mark where his mouth was and he won the championship. Holy crap, what a historical moment on WWTE Wrestling, guys. Let's go backstage and hear what Michael has to say about him losing his Intercontinental Championship. But this is one hell of a matchup. Smash the like button, subscribe. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm here with the WT Tough Enough winner, Michael. So, Michael, how do you feel about losing your Intercontinental Championship to The Rock last episode, which was the pay per view event Extreme Limit? Well, honestly, The Rock beat me fair and square. But, honestly, at the same time, I pretty much just let that son of a bitch win because we all know that I could have beaten The Rock if I really tried. And that's all I have to say. Oh, Michael seemed a little uh, upset there. So we need to get the EMTs out here. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Turn on notifications for more videos. We thank you so much for all for watching, and don't forget to stay awesome.